Hello, welcome to Fernhill School. I'm Miss Ellis, the head teacher, and it's lovely to see you with us today. Hi, I'm Riley, I'm in year seven. And I'm Ruby, and I'm in year eight, and we're going to tell you about our school. Now, we're going to give you a tour of the school. We're going to take you around, show you some of the important places, and give you a chance to get familiar with the whole site. So to do that, I'm going to hand you over to Mr Baker and he is going to take you on your visit. So have a lovely time and I'll see you again soon. Welcome Year 6. Good to see you. I'm Mr Baker, Assistant Head in Charge of Pastoral Care and I'm going to take you on a tour. Let's start with the PE area. So here we are in PE and of course you've done PE at primary school but because we're a second school we offer much more sport than you can do there. Here at Fern Hill there are many sports that you can participate in, such as basketball, football, dodgeball, tennis, netball and so on. Let's now go to the front of the school, where we're going to go into the main hall. So here we are in the main hall. This is where you'll come for your first day and where you'll have weekly assemblies but also where you'll have school productions. Let's go on to the drama studio. Here we are in the drama studio. You'll have drama once a fortnight, a great chance to express yourself. Here in drama, we do six different subjects for each half term. We do different types of acting like miming and, and murder mysteries. And we get to do games and competitions. Behind these curtains are all the props you will need to make an excellent production. It's now time to go to music, which is this way. Here we are in one of the music rooms. We have a number of different music rooms for you to play your instruments. And in here we have computers so you can write your own music. Round the corner for music is the English department. Let's go and see it. Here we are in the English department. We have a number of fantastic English teachers that will teach you about poetry, how to write expressive stories, as well as looking at text. In English, we sometimes get to act out different scripts and every week we do a word of the week and that's where we learn a new word and the meaning of it and try to use it in sentences. We're now going to go to a very important part in the school, the pastoral office. Here is the pastoral office. Let me introduce you to Miss Sabotier. Hello Year 6 and welcome to the pastoral office. I'm a normal teaching member of staff so I'm here all the time. If you're having a bad day and you need some support, this is where you'll find me. We're now going to move down to the humanities department. So what is the Humanities Department? Well here you will study Geography, History and RE lessons. And here are some examples of work Year 7 did last year. Outside of Humanities is the Playground. Let's go and see it. So here we have beautiful grounds. And in the summer you can go out and play on the beautiful fields of Fern Hill and also the tennis court. Outside of the main building is the maths block. Let's go and see that. And here we are in the maths block where you'll have your maths lessons every week and also we have our two main computer suites. I really enjoy maths. It's one of my favourite subjects and a big difference from primary school is we get to do a lot more variety of different types of maths. We're now going to go to the inclusion area and the SSC. Here we are in the Student Support Centre and the inclusion area. This is a fantastic safe place if you're feeling anxious or you need some support with your learning. We're now going to go back to the main part of the building and see the technology department. Here we are in one of a number of our food rooms where you will learn to cook and use knives and equipment. On the other side of the corridor from technology is the science department.
Here we are in one of our many science labs where you will learn to do all kinds of experiments and learn all things about the world. One of the biggest differences in science is the experiments. One of my favourite experiments was with magnesium as we had to cover our eyes as it produced such a bright light. Next door to our lab is one of our computer suites. We have a number of computer rooms like this where you will learn computer programming and coding. At the end of the science corridor is the art department. Let's go and have a look. Welcome to the art department, a fantastic place for you to develop your creative juices, whether it be in oils, chalk or pencil drawing. In art we've had lots of fun painting, but we've also made models like these pinch pots. And it's not just the art department where you can be creative. Let's go next door to design and technology. Welcome to the wood room, one of the many rooms where you can be creative using all kinds of materials to make all kinds of objects. In DT you create and design all sorts of things. Last term we made these bead mazes. We're now going to go from the technology department upstairs to the languages department. Bonjour, hola. Here in the language department, you'll either choose to do French in that room or Spanish in that room. Along from the languages department is the business studies department. Now you won't be doing that until GCSE, but also this is where my classroom is. Let's go and see. So I teach GCSE and A-level history, but my room is also used as a tutor group room. And here we see their display and you will have one the same. Now your tutor will register you and see you every morning and every afternoon. Welcome to the school library. A fantastic, safe, calm, quiet place in the sense of the school. You will have reading lessons here, but also you can use this both before school and at break and lunchtime. From the library, we're going to go up the main corridor to the canteen, a place students love to go. Here we are in the canteen. Both for break and lunch time, you can queue up and buy all kinds of lovely hot foods if you want to do so, or you can just eat your packed lunches here. At Fun Hill, there is a wide variety of food that you can get at break time and lunch time. Whereas in primary school, you were only given a tray of food and that was your lunch. And it is a great time to socialise with your friends. I get lunch every day and the burgers and chicken are amazing. Students often ask how they can pay for school dinners at Fern Hill. We use a cashless system here where you can load money onto your account using your thumb. You place your thumb here and then you load the cash into this slot. Or your parents can pay on the School Gateway app. Now let's go into the canteen where you will buy food. Here in the food hall, you can purchase food early in the morning, break time and at lunch time. When you enter into the food hall, you'll be asked to clean your hands and collect a tray. We serve a variety of hot and cold tasty dishes. When you've made your selection, you'll be asked to pay using your thumb at the kiosk. We're now going to head down the main corridor to the front of the school, where I'm going to show you one last area, the student reception. Here is the student reception at the front of the school. If you have to leave the school for a medical appointment or you're not feeling very well, it is here where you'll be brought and we'll look after you. The final part of the school we haven't been to see is where our head teacher is. Shall we go and see that now? Hello again. Wow, well I hope that you've had a lovely visit and that you've had a chance to just imagine what it's actually like here at Fernhill on an ordinary day. So this is where I work and I may, I'm out and about a lot as well. So I know that we are going to meet you very soon. So I'll take you round to the front entrance now so we can say goodbye and I hope you've got lots to think about. Okay, let's go. So here we are, back where we started. Here's the exit. 
I hope you have a lovely rest of the day and we look forward to seeing you soon. Take care. Bye.